Windows Server 2016 gives us the ability in Active Directory to enable what's called a recycling bin. And that allows us to recover deleted items. If we delete anything in Active Directory, we can recover it fairly easily. So in Server Manager, go to the Tools menu at the top and go to Active Directory Administrative Center. Now you have to make sure all your domain controllers are turned on before you attempt this, otherwise you'll get an error. We'll go ahead and click on the domain and then go ahead and click on Enable Recycle Bin. Now once it's enabled, then it will gray out like you see here. And the reason I did this ahead of time is because it does take time to replicate with the other domain controllers. Once that's done, you'll go ahead and see this new folder that appears called Deleted Objects. So if we want to, we can recover deleted objects that have been deleted since the recycle bin's been enabled. So let's go ahead and go to Users. We'll double click on Users. And let's go ahead and delete our template user. So we'll right click and we'll choose Delete. And we'll choose Yes. Now we'll go back to our domain and we'll double click on Deleted Objects. And there is our template user. Let's go ahead and right click and choose Restore. We'll go back to our domain once again and we'll go to the Users folder where it was. And there's our template user, it's been restored. Now by default, after 180 days, the recycle bin will empty itself. So you won't have forever to leave this in the deleted items like you would some other programs. Once you enable Recycle Bin, in order to get the Recycle Bin working as fast as possible, you can go up to PowerShell. You just go ahead and type in PowerShell from a run command or just do a search for it. And you will type the rep admin space forward slash sync all. And then it will synchronize between all the different domain controllers right away. So you won't have to wait very long before it enables itself. You might have to close Active Directory Administrative Center and open it back up again in order to see uh, the deleted folder as well. So there is the results of the sync all. And you can see that it finished and there are no errors. If you do see errors, then you will not be able to enable the recycle bin until those errors are resolved. So you can look those up on TechNet to see uh, what may be causing those problems. So that's how you enable and recover deleted items using the Recycle Bin in Windows Server 2016 Active Directory.